Hey guys, it's Colin here at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at the Thule Wing Bar Evo roof rack system on our 2018 Subaru Crosstrek. Now with this system, it's going to mount to the raised side rails of your Crosstrek. It's going to be a really nice addition to your Subaru for getting your favorite rooftop accessories loaded up, whether you've got a bike rack, kayak carrier, maybe even a rooftop cargo box. Now up top, we're going to have our 53 inch long Wing Bar Evo crossbars. These are in black right now, but they're also available in silver. If you think that's going to match your cross track better, just check out our website and pick the one that's going to best suit your needs. Now the aerodynamic shape of our crossbar is going to be really good for cutting down on that wind noise and drag when compared to your standard square or round bar roof rack system. We can flip open our cap just like that to access our T-slot and all we have to do is split the two strips and slide our T-slot accessory to the location on our roof rack and then tighten it down. Then we'll just close up our end cap. Now we have our Evo raised rail feet connecting our wing bar Evo crossbars to our raised side rails of our cross trek. These are gonna have a nice rubber coating on the insides to make sure it doesn't harm or scratch the finish of your side rails. We'll open up our end cap so you can take a look at the inside. All it is is a bolt. Once you tighten that down, it's gonna tighten the clamp on the back side to make sure it gives a really nice snug fit for our raised side rail. We just put our end cap back on. You can see we got some plastic locks right here. We can replace that with the Thule one key system. That'll be able to get four keys on all four of our Evo raised rail feet. So that it's a nice secure feature for our roof rack. Now from the top of our roof to the bottom of our wing bar, it's gonna be three and a quarter inches. You wanna keep that in mind for when you get your clamp on accessories under your crossbar. It's gonna be more than enough space for it, but just make sure you're careful and don't harm or scratch the finish of your roof. Now, when we go from the top of our roof to the top of our wing bar, that's gonna be four and a quarter inches. You wanna keep that in mind that you have that added height to your roof for any low clearance situations. We're also gonna have a 220 pound weight capacity on this roof rack system. It's gonna be a step up from their previous uh, aero blade setup, and it's gonna be a little bit more than a lot of other aero bar systems on the market. So you should be able to get all of your favorite rooftop accessories up here and loaded with no problem. Just make sure you double check with your vehicle's owner's manual. Make sure your Crosstrex roof can handle that weight. Now that we've gone over some of those features, let's show you guys how to get this installed. Now when assembling it, all we're gonna do is take our raised rail foot and put it in the track right here on the bottom. It's pretty easy how it goes on. You can see it just matches up like so. Just like that, grab our end cap, put that on. Now we'll just raise it up and get it on our side rails. Now there's no set measurement that you need to get it at. You just wanna make sure it's at least 27 inches. Now in our case, how we're gonna get this installed, we're not gonna use a tape measure. It's a nice little handy trick. Just use points that are on your raised side rails. So the front bar, we have each foot making contact with this point right here. Now on this back side, we've already measured to confirm it's at least 27 inches. We're just gonna have it touch this part right here. So we'll just make sure we get that on both sides. And all I'm gonna do is begin tightening down that bolt with my finger on both sides. So we'll just take our included tool and tighten down our bolt right here. What's cool is that this tool is gonna to let you know when it's fully torqued by giving you those loud audible clicks. And from there, just put your end cap on. And it's always a good idea to grab a hold of both of your crossbars and then double check to make sure that it's tight and secure. You can see the entire vehicle is moving. So now we're ready to load up our favorite Thule rooftop accessories and then hit the road. Well, thank you all for watching and I hope this information helped you out. But that's gonna do it for our test fit of the Thule Wing Bar Evo roof rack system on our 2018 Subaru Crosstrek.